What's good? Now today, you guys read the title and you're interested about this video because you clicked on it and I'll be talking about Madden Mobile 21 structure of gameplay, not structure plus gameplay, it's just the structure of gameplay and also um, because there was no gameplay, uh, they gave us a little bit extra of a sneak peeks in that video only because he was Nick who was in the, you know, talking about the whole, you know, structure of the gameplay thing gave us a little bit more. He gave us the man today, how uh, that's looking, and also some of the sneak peeks of these sets. So that's also dope. But honestly, um, this is going to be a fun one. So make sure you guys dropped a like on this video and also are subscribed to the channel with your post notifications on so you never miss out on upcoming news on this channel. And yeah, let's get right into the sneak peeks for Madden Mobile 21. Now, if you guys were up in the morning at 11 a.m. Eastern, ready for this live stream, then you guys have got in a little bit of information and we're kind of a little bit sad that we didn't get actual gameplay and so yeah i have important information to give to you guys today about uh what's happening and it's pretty interesting because i thought i was gonna give you guys some gameplay you know like what what it's looking like and all that stuff but change of plans it's the structure of the gameplay and a little bit of extra sneak peeks so let's move on to slide number two which is the quarterback badge, um, which is interesting because I don't know if they're going to be, um, you know, they're obviously going to do like wide receiver, tight end, center, D and D tackle badges. Maybe. I don't know. But there is badges for a player that you want, uh, which I don't know what it provides and all that stuff, but it probably provides some boost to your quarterback or to any player that you want to get that badge for. Um, there is a blank badge. There's a quarterback evolution um there is the there's like some some, some sort of dust i don't even know what that is but it's some sort of dust we also got coins which you need 250 coins not 1 billion coins everyone in the live stream i've seen in the comments they're like we need 1 million coins for that badge um which kind of brought me thinking like if we needed 1 million coins for this badge they would not give it to us right away because we cannot even get the badge um and all that stuff but the one hard thing that should be um really hard to get this badge is with the dust the dust should be hard to get but the coin should be easy because it's only 250 and that should be really easy these badges should be easy to get i'm kind of thinking that we need to upgrade these badges if they're this easy to get but that's only if uh the dust and the badges and the blank badge is hard to get we don't know yet we'll only know when august 6 um comes out and we actually open the game and play it for it um for ourselves and stuff so that's something to actually leave on a high note and hopefully is good Later on in the season, we're going to head on to slide number three, uh, which is the sets. This is how the sets are looking. Uh, pretty clean old look. Okay. It is having like how the, um, you know, those four little cards are looking like how it is in Mad Mobile 20, which is interesting, but how these sets are looking is pretty dope. Now, how are they going to like put the whole layout of the sets? Are they, are they going to go back to Mad Mobile 15 and 16 years and 17, all that stuff, all those years? Or are they gonna, you know, bring Mad Mobile 20 sets back? Uh, which I loved the Mad Mobile 15, 16 sets. They were easy to play. They're really simple. I feel like sets now and how everything with the promos and stuff are way more advanced. It's kind of harder to get. It's kind of harder to do. You need way more like pieces of the puzzle to put together to freaking. It's like it's it's too much. Okay, we need some sweet and simple um, things to do. Like. Uh, if we can play something and actually get rewarded this badge like in the man today and stuff, which I'm pretty sure is the next slide. Uh, slide number four is the man today. This is reminding me back then. This, this is this is taking me down a trip to memory lane. So this is pretty good. Um, how this is all looking. This this has th this look looks nothing like Madden Mobile 20. Madden Mobile 20. Madden Mobile 20's man today look and their loading screen look looks like um overdrive and it kind of really made me like eh because it was not like a little upgrade like i feel like they should have stuff going on like when there's a promo in the game they should update the man today how the background looks or like something's changed like the loading screens you should be able to get different loading screens like I, that would be awesome like like i don't want to see the same loading screen for a whole year of just like a plain gray screen with it just saying different stuff like could we get different loading screens like in console, we have different loading screens for different players um, like Old Dell or Todd Gurley or anyone in the NFL. So that is actually actually something that I would like to the game um, and all that stuff. But it will probably not be added or something. But they are going to change out how the look is looking. So, 
you know, I'm going to see some new stuff. I want to see some old stuff from back then. Um, and not from like overdrive like I, I feel like they should put some different game modes in I want a new change to the game and I know you guys do too. So we're gonna head on to slide number five With uh, the rewards and the sets which is XP coins your dust. So when you guys play a um, a You know event from the man today you guys will be rewarded with badges and dust and coins and all that stuff So that will help you get a badge. So I'm pretty sure badges are gonna be easy to get so that is why I'm thinking about upgrading badges to like different sort of levels like level 1, 2, 3, and max is 10 for a quarterback, wide receiver, any position out there that is actually interesting. And on the, um, I think, right hand corner, you guys are going to see stamina and autofill. And that is slide number 6, which is the stamina, um, which is looking different, as I said, I'm pretty sure in the beginning of the video, but it's looking different. Um, and we got the auto on the event. Uh, for certain events, different events won't have auto. You can just play multiple times. And all the stuff which i think is pretty dope but um with the auto it's just like playing multiple times uh but i'm pretty sure after the 20 you play you have to spend like i don't know maybe a hundred dust i don't know i don't know what currency is in this game i'm pretty sure they're taking out gems and putting like some sort of dust in i don't know may maybe when you're done with the 20 of those you gotta do like 50 of the like dust or something i don't know what it's called but it's some sort of dust it's like some blue like diamond or ruby i don't know it's pretty interesting we're looking at a new look of this new game this new app and it's pretty interesting heading on to slide number six or seven i lost track in the slides i'm pretty sure this is number six or seven but it doesn't matter about what number of the slides are it matters about what we're looking at and that is the um the core loop the structure of the gameplay how it's looking and that is the play um the collect the craft and trade the upgrade and the recycle now this is pretty interesting this is some different stuff on here and honestly i don't really get the full understanding of what this means uh, but if you guys do check out the madden mobile um twitch live stream it should be like a replay of it so if you guys can go to ea madden nfl you guys can get some you know insight on that because honestly how he was explaining it with the other person he was with was kind of interesting in a way and kind of hard to grasp because there were, it was so complicated. It was it was so complicated. Uh, even the comments were like, this is like so complicated. Like, what is this? This was hard. A lot. There was a lot of bad comments, a lot of good comments, a lot of like, wow, oh, this is cool, all that stuff. And honestly, it was interesting, interesting to see, honestly. I'm sorry if I was like, miss, I was like, ugh, because honestly, I am just like, wow because this game these sneak peeks that we just got to me were pretty interesting i i love them if you guys didn't then i'm sorry and all that stuff but honestly a new app and all that stuff is pretty dope also remember to link your e accounts so you guys can be the first one to look and you know touch up on this new app of madden mobile 21 the first ones to play be the first ones to play by linking your e account and all that stuff also if you guys are having trouble with that um i could make a video but it's honestly no purpose just um, the three uh, icon bars, click on it. You guys go to um, the settings where you link your accounts to like Google, Facebook, or anything. And it's right there. It says EA account link. Click on that. And basically, you guys can just link your account. Sweet and simple. So hopefully, you guys did enjoy this video. Remember, Master Series is next Monday. And then we're going to get, I think, three more until August 6th, which is the actual game. So that is really, really, really hype. I, like, these sneak peeks were okay. I'm like feeling vibes about back then. But honestly uh master series is gonna be pretty dope i'll give you guys those sneak peeks next monday throughout the week you guys will also get videos so remember to keep your post notifications on and also drop a like on this video honestly i will provide you guys with all the madden woman 21 news i can get for you guys but that's been this has been a good video honestly these sneak peeks are pretty good i'm like my tongue is twisted i'm losing my words right now and i'm sorry for that i'll catch you guys in the next one peace